Hi friend, hi friends, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are doing great. Today I'm showing you how I decorate my dining area for fall. Oh, here I am, hi. Let me brighten this place. I'm, I'm clearly using my cell phone, so the quality is going to be a little iffy, but bear with me, okay? So let me just show you how I decorate my dining room for fall. This wreath is from Home Goods. It's velvet. So let me see if I can actually get closer. So you guys can see how soft it is. Um, this mirror used to be a black mirror. What I did was I went ahead and I painted it rose gold with spray paint. And it's really, really long and it goes all the way down. Okay, so that's that. Now let's actually start with the dining room area. Okay, here is my dining room and the table. Now how I'm decorating for fall is I'm keeping it very, very simple. Uh, we eat in this dining room every day and so my whole goal is to make sure that it's not too crowded and it's not like It's usable. So the centerpiece the main part of the centerpiece, which is This part is actually from Hobby Lobby. Uh, it's from home goods. Okay. I wanted the pumpkins to be more full So I went to Hobby Lobby and I picked up extra pumpkins and I just went ahead and kind of like clipped those in there. So that is that. So if you go buy this from Home Goods, you're not going to get it this way. You have to put in extra things to make it feel full. Then on the side, I bought these decorative pumpkins from Target. And these are real pumpkins. And I just kind of like put them on the side on each side of the centerpiece right there. And it's so pretty and it's so homey and it makes me feel like i'm home every time i walk into the door so that is how i decorate the center table very very simple okay then let me show you how i decorate my credenza now i love my credenza this little guy is over 100 years old <clears throat> excuse me i bought her off of craigslist about a month ago from this old lady who gave it to her daughter never mind you don't need to hear that <laughs> but this is over my bless this nest sign that I did this sign myself. And I'm going to link the link for you to watch how to do this sign in the description box somewhere in this video. But let me get closer to how I decorate this credenza. As you can tell, it's very simple, very crisp, nothing crazy. Just because I wanted to keep it usable because we still put food on here and I wanted to make it just very simple. So I have this old um, bowl and I just filled it up with fake white pumpkin these ones are from target and the big ones are from hobby lobby and then on this side i just have this uh bucket that is from hobby uh, michael's this is no this is actually from home goods and i just filled it up with wood <laughs> that i got from outside then i have fresh lavender from my garden i harvested them and here they are sitting in this vase on the credenza so Pretty simple, straightforward, it gets the work done. Finally, let me show you my china cabinet. This is my favorite piece in the dining room. The color initially was brown. I went ahead and I painted this to give it this antique look and I love it. So <clears throat> on top that, let me actually brighten this up. There we go. On top, that little reef up there, that is actually from... Oh, actually, let me see. Yes. So on top, uh, that little uh, reef, uh, no, no reef, garland is actually from Hobby Lobby. And I've had those for a few years. So let me take you closer. The grateful sign is from Home Goods, And I kind of move it around the whole house. But right now, it's sitting in my china cabinet. In the corner here, I have this old skill I got from an antique shop. And I have that pumpkin on top of it. And I just have... This little pumpkins from Target as well. The same thing for that as area. So honestly, I feel like have fun with it. Feel free to decorate for the seasons. It's going to make lasting memories for your children, for your family, for your spouse, for your for yourself. It's so fun decorating. Um, so this is just all the little twigs and little things I did to just make it feel very homey. So... There we go. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I just wanted to give you an overview. <clears throat> if you have any questions, please ask. But I encourage you to decorate your home for the holidays. It brings lasting memories and it's so worth it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>